Hello guys, how are you today? My name is Abdul Aziz Ahwan from Indonesia and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to continue our previous video and in this video, we are going to set up our category screen. So let's open our previous project. So this is our previous project and for now, we need to go to our category screen dot that file. So in the previous, we return text widget right here and for now we need to return scaffold widget and inside this scaffold widget we say app bar and we provide app bar and we provide title and text widget inside that and we say categories and when we run our app and press categories and we can see app bar with title categories and the next step is let's say we want to provide body and pass our text widget right here and press hot reload and we can see welcome to category screen and let's say we want to make our text widget to be center and it's as simple like this firstly we need to press our text widget and we see like yellow bulb and we say warp with center and when we hot reload it our text widget will be on the center the next step is let's say we want to add floating action button and floating action button have many properties and let's hot reload it and we see floating action button and we want to give icon inside that with child and we say icon dot add and we see plus icon and let's click this when we click left arrow it will back to our drawer navigation let's say when we press this it will navigate to our home screen so firstly we need to go to app bar and inside this app bar we say leading and inside this leading properties we say rise button and we need to provide child and icon let's say icon arrow back and how to load it and we see rise button with white background and let's change the color with colors properties and we say colors blue and how to reload it and we see change to blue but we see shadow so to remove that we need to say elevation 0, 0.0 hot reload again and now our shadow has removed to change icon color we need to go to icon right here and inside that we say color and we say color dot white and we see our icon change to white and let's say when we press our rise button we need to navigate to home screen so we change this to navigator of context push material page root and we say builder context and we navigate to home screen and let's click this and now it navigate to our home screen back to our category screen again and let's say when we press this we want to show dialog right here so we need to create a new right here show form dialog and we say build context and inside that we want to return show dialog for the context set it to context and then for the barrier dismissible set it true and for the builder we set it to param and inside that we want to return again alert dialog and inside this alert dialog we want to give title it means we need to provide text widget inside this and let's say categories from how to reload it when we press this nothing appears 
So firstly, we need to use this in our floating action button. Inside on press and we need to say context and we need to provide semicolon right here hot reload again and press this and now we see dialog right here with title categories form go to our show form dialog again and insert our alert dialog we can give another properties let's say content and we use single child scroll view and inside this we say child with column because we want to add some widget inside that and inside this column we say children and we can give text field widget inside this text field we can provide properties the first one is decoration and we say input decoration and for the hint text we say write a uh, categories and for the label text we say category and let's hot reload again press this and we see categories with hint text write a category so we need to duplicate our text field and change this to description and this one to description hot reload again and now we see two text field the next step is let's say we want to add two button right here so we need to go to our alert dialog and we say action and inside this action we can provide some widget inside that let's say the first one is flat button for the on press we set it to blank and for the child let's say text widget and we say cancel and duplicate this hot reload again press this and now we see cancel and this is save button so we need to change this to save and let's say we want to change the color let's say colors dot blue and for the cancel let's say we want to set it to red hot reload again and now we see save and cancel and let's say when we press this cancel button it will navigate to our category screen so right here we say navigator dot pop context hot reload again press this and it will back to category screen okay so that's enough our video see you on the next video